Hey everybody, it's Nicola here. Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Leaf. It's a very, wow, very blue sky, pretty day today. Anyways, um, yeah, we're back here with some more Animal Crossing, mainly because Patty is of course moving, well, tomorrow, but today's her last day in town, so I figured I wanted to go and say goodbye to her. She's the first villager that's actually leaving our town. So here she is, she's all packed up. Hey Patty. Look who the cow dragged in. <laughs> I've been waiting for you to stop by, I just had to say thank you. I thought long and hard about what you said. I even missed an episode of Dramatic Cow Stories. Whoa. But I'm glad I spent so much time thinking. I decided to move and my new home's gonna be so sweet. Oh well I'll miss you. Promise me you'll try to enjoy life in Lumico without me. You'll have to have fun for the both of us. Aw, well thanks for your somewhat short time here, but you made me feel welcome, so thanks Patty. Um, good luck in your new town, wherever that may be. Aw, that was kind of sad. <laughs> I don't normally drop in on villagers who move, but I kind of wanted to make this more sort of like personal for the, for the YouTube videos. So that's kind of nice to just go and say goodbye to her. Um, the other thing I want to do is head into retail because um, there's something I kind of neglected to show thus far and oh hey Reese and that is that there's another alpaca who runs the store over here this is Cyrus but unfortunately he's sleeping right now stop my darling is extremely tired from working all night so please let him get some sleep okay okay well I figured like since I haven't actually shown that he's over here yet, um, that I would. And hopefully he'll be waking up soon in the next couple days, that'd be really cool. But yeah, aside from Patty moving, um, there isn't a huge amount of stuff going on really. Uh, Club LOL is still in the process of being built, and um, no new stores thus far on Main Street. But maybe we'll have a cool visitor today in town, I haven't actually explored my town at all today, so I'm just gonna have a little wander around here. Becky, Ugh. Uh, oh Muffy, I'll talk to you. <laughs> How are you doing? You want me to give you furniture? Oh, again, like I don't have enough furniture to spare. I'm sorry. Maybe there'll be something in uh, TNT Mart today. That would be kind of nice. You know, I really have no idea what you do all day. Are you super sly or am I just not paying attention? Man, this is no good. I bet there's all sorts of stuff I'm missing out on. <laughs> well, you know, I'm just, you know, being mayor and stuff. Like, nothing too exciting. Oh, hey. There's a rumor going around about you. You heard? Everyone's saying Nicola is quite the fashionista. Well, I'm glad I'm holding on to this title. Everyone keeps telling me about it. Yeah, I'm looking pretty sweet today. Got my pink shoes on bought them at Kicks. Uh, I think that was yesterday. Um, Alright, well there's nobody in the plaza today, but that's alright. Um, I've kind of not had every special visitor yet, which is kind of frustrating a little bit, but it is still quite early days, so I can't expect to have everything at once here. Ooh, something on the board. Tomorrow is Shamrock Day. You might get pinched if you don't wear green, so apparently... Alright, well, <laughs> we'll be back tomorrow for Shamrock Day, I guess. Um, and we also... Uh, yesterday it posted that um, the cherry blossoms are coming, which is going to be really pretty. Our town is going to be nice and pink and awesome and pink. <laughs> All the trees will turn into cherry blossoms, which will be really pretty actually. Um, looking forward to that. I guess we are officially in spring when that happens, right? So I'm just going to... Um, oh, I got a slingshot by the way. I finally found one in TNT Marks and I can like shoot down the balloons like a pro. And I'll definitely be sure to do that because you get some really cool stuff from them. Like, we got actually did get a piece of the balloon furniture already, but you can also get other pieces of random furniture as well. And the way you upgrade the slingshot is simply by using it. Sahara again? Alright, well, okay, let's talk to Sahara. Hey, I'm called Sahara, yes, I know, I've, I've met you like twice already. <laughs> sure. We shall head to my palace in a second here. Um, let me just check to see if anybody's at the campsite. I did have someone at the campsite yesterday, actually. Um, what was his name? It was Ken the Chicken, which is a great name for a chicken. 
Um, I don't know, he was like, uh, he was like a black chicken and he had like ninja outfit on. He looked pretty cool, but I don't really want to invite anyone into my town since it's already so full, unless it's someone that I know already. Like, if Robert turned up, he would be straight in here, no question. Like, I would not take no for an answer. I'd be there all day pestering him until he decided to move in. Uh, but yeah, we're digging up some gyroids as well because yesterday it was actually raining. It was very beautiful. And we have quite a few weeds actually. I wonder if the rain increases the number of weeds. I'm not actually sure. But yeah, uh, there's Groucho down here. We can maybe say hi to him. Uh, after we've dropped off uh, Sahara at our house to give us our makeover dreams and hopes and everything. Alright, well please don't like wreck my house while you're in there. Okay, thank you. I did actually get the desert wall. Remember how I got Sahara's desert, the carpet? I actually got the desert wall. Um, it's like the Desert Vista, I think it's called. Um, but yeah, my home is like still like this. <laughs> hey, it's like exactly the same as the last time. Are you gonna give me anything cool? Maybe. We'll see. Man, my outfit's pretty awesome today. I'm quite happy with it. I like it when... The thing about wearing skirts in New Leaf is that I feel like they start too low down your body. Or like the t-shirt is sort of like it comes down too far so it kind of makes you look a little bit like disproportionate but the dress is like like this how it has that like cinched in bit at the waist it actually makes it look a lot nicer and i wish the skirts were kind of more this size but i guess it would look strange when you wore trousers right so i guess it's just a bit of a, a balance but yeah you can design some really nice dresses that kind of have this sort of flared out skirt look so I like that. Anyway, I'm just <laughs> talking about my clothes. Um, ooh. I think this is like a desert floor, right? Let's see. Uh, the library wall, which is actually really cool. And the western desert. I have a feeling that that's a special one. So thank you, Sahara. I much appreciate it. Although I have had you like three times. I've had Katrina three times. But I'm still missing... Um, Ironically, what was here on the very first day of town that I chose to ignore, which I'm now regretting, and uh, a couple of other things as well, but hey look who's here, Wolfgang. Oh, you do some gardening, dude? What's up? Yo, Nicola. Oh, don't be mean. Why is everyone mean about my face? <laughs> on days like this, I want to down a cup of beet juice and refresh myself by working up a sweat. Hey, I had you down this maybe slightly more lazy than that, so I'm glad you're out like doing the gardening and stuff. That reminds me, this Saturday is the fishing tourney, it is. I'm pretty confident in my fishing skills. You think you can beat me? Bring it. <laughs> oh, it's on, dude. I will totally wreck you. So yeah, we have um, Shamrock Day tomorrow and then on Saturday the fishing tourney. So it's going to be a, a nice week. This is actually kind of like our first actual event. So this is pretty exciting. Um, finally getting into some more stuff than just daily life. And of course, daily life makes up like... The majority of this game, obviously, but it is nice to have events now and again, as long as they're not too... you don't feel too pressured to take part in them. So yeah, digging up my fossils, doing all that stuff. Um, I actually have some stuff to donate to the museum, so I may do that today, because I think I have a bunch of complete fossils. Um, just in my wardrobe, because I've kept them to be like, okay, I'll donate them all at once when the dinosaur is finished and I actually have quite a few standalone pieces as well as a few completed dinosaurs so I may grab all that stuff and head over there and like meet you over there and we could have a little explore of the museum potentially. Uh, thanks Sahara, thank you again. <laughs> um, hey Muffy, we talked to you, should we talk to Becky? Go on then. Well good morning, lovely to see you. Yeah, you too. <laughs> I hate to ask you for a favour, but could you please run a delivery for me? You see, I found something that Muffy lost. Yeah, sure, I can do that. Muffy's just over there. Cheers. I will take care of that straight away. Yeah, okay. I mean, I'll talk to you, like, one more time. Since I already have a favour for you, you can't give me another favour, so let's see what actual chat you have. And there's such a thing as being too glamorous, because if there is, I'm guilty as charged. <laughs> And it's partially thanks to this ornate outfit, don't you agree, Nicola? You actually do look pretty cool with that on. It's not really my style, the ornate stuff, but I can see that it does suit you. Okay, Nicola, from one girl to another, do you usually wear makeup? Uh, no, not usually. 
Why, you look great! And so natural! I'm jealous of your complexion. You'll have to share your skincare routine with me sometime. Why do you have to do the evil face? Oh, okay. Like, sure. I mean, whatever, dude. <laughs> hey, Muffy, I have something for you. Hey, listen, I figured it out. If you want to wake yourself up in the morning, just get yourself outside. Hey, that- yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Um, let's see. Delivery here. Uh, to Muffy. Here you go. Huh? This is something I lost? My dog tooth shirt! I thought I'd lost this forever! This is great! You gonna put it on? Replace that ugly scarf? <laughs> no, never mind. Not much, but please take this. Oh, I get a shirt now. I wouldn't have minded that dog tooth shirt myself. Blue tie-dye tank. Okay, I mean, yeah, whatever. It's a bit too, um... I don't know, it's, it's not particularly my taste, but I quite like it being a tank top as opposed to t-shirts. So yeah, I could maybe fit that into some of my outfits, perhaps. Alright, hey, where'd you go, Becky? Here, I did the thing. Yeah, I delivered it. So Muffy didn't even realise anything was lost? Well, I'm glad I returned it anyway. Yeah, I guess you did a good deed. Um, Alright, well, I guess um, I will go and pick up all those fossils that I need to donate, and I'll head over to the museum, and then we'll just have a little wander around and look at all our dinosaur finds. So, yeah, I'll see you in just a second. Alright, here we are in the museum. I'm just going to head into the dinosaur exhibit and just have a little wander around. It's kind of peaceful in here. I do quite like it, although... Like I said before, I can actually get a little bit lost in here, so let's see what we got so far. Ooh, dinosaurs. Lovely. So yeah, you can read stuff about them, and it's pretty interesting. Um, Blathers used to kind of tell us all this stuff himself, but now it's kind of so you're not forced to read it, it's now put on the little plaques, so I guess that's a better option. Um, but yeah, I got quite a few more standalone pieces. Look at this. An Ammonite, that's right. Uh... But yeah, we got uh, quite a few, so this is nice. Um, it's starting to fill out a little bit. There's still quite a few um, empty spaces, of course, but I think I donated about maybe four fossils, uh, like big dinosaurs or so. Um, so I'll try to find them all real quick. Uh, here's a big one over here. Whoa. His little head. There it is. <laughs> yeah, we have these really cool, like... Um, wall things at the back, like these images. I really like these. Um, I like the little touch of just putting this in, but you can't really see them very well with the camera, but anyways, um, this is it. We we only added a few, but we still made a, a decent bit of progress. Um, I do have most of like the fossils in at home, but I'm just waiting until I have like all three pieces or all two pieces or all like four pieces. There's some big dinosaurs, so I just wanted to not really put half completed things in there, so I hope you understand, but um, <laughs> Blathers has gone back to sleep. But anyways, um, that's really all I wanted to do today, um, not a huge amount going on, but we'll be back over the next couple days for some more holiday event type things, so that'll be pretty exciting. So um, yeah, a couple more Animal Crossing videos for me this week, which is cool, it's what we want, just to sort of pop in every now and again, and of course, when uh, Patty moves out, there's an opportunity for someone else to move in, so I'll be sure to show whoever that is and we can share the excitement together of going into the house for the first time. But anyways, uh, that's it for today, so thank you very much for watching and I shall see you next video.